don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell, then click all. Thanks. Hi everyone, welcome back. And today I have for you from the Born Pretty store a beautiful set of fine glitters. There is 12 in the set and you can purchase the whole set for $7 or you can buy them individually for $1.69. I am gonna show you how to apply these to your nail just by using a no wipe top coat. All the products that I use in this video will have the item number on the screen. That makes it easier for you to look them up on the Born Pretty site. Also, the links will be in the description box too. I have a discount code for you, Denise20, for 20% off your total order, so take advantage of that. I'm using their peel off base coat, and this is because I want to remove these nails fairly soon. And then I am using their no wipe top coat, and I'm using that to apply the glitter. And then I will be top coating this in a no wipe matte top coat. I've already applied the peel off base gel, cured it for one minute. And now it's time to apply the no wipe top coat and the glitter. And when you apply the top coat, you just want to make sure you get a nice even layer and that you cover all the nail because this is going to determine where and how much of the glitter sticks to your nail. And if you miss a spot, there won't be any glitter there. Before you apply the glitter, you want to put a piece of paper down and then start applying your glitter. And this will help for you to be able to put all of your glitter back in the pot when we're done because the glitter gets everywhere. I just use this nail cuticle pusher and it acts as a little spoon and I apply the glitter on my nail and I am pointing my nail in a downward position. And this kind of helps the glitter to just kind of fall and roll right down off my nail. Be sure to tap it every now and then and apply that glitter everywhere. And then once you get the glitter on and you feel your nail is covered enough, you just put it in the lamp and cure it for one minute. Now that it's cured, I come in with a stiff bristled brush and I brush off all that excess glitter because you want to get most of that off, if not all of it because you don't want that to go into your top coat bottle when you're top coating. And now I'm just using this needle tool to come in the side walls and remove any loose glitter and around the cuticle area. So be careful when you're applying the top coat that you don't get it too close to the cuticle and that will avoid that. And here you can see why I used a piece of paper underneath when I was working to catch the glitter and I creased the paper too and it just makes it a lot easier to put all that glitter back in your pot and none is wasted. And now it's time to top coat. I chose a matte top coat, but you can of course use a shiny top coat if that's your preference. Now the first layer, you could get away with just using one layer of the matte top coat, but I think for me, that's a little bit too textured. So I went ahead and did a second coat of the matte top coat and you cure each layer for one minute in your lamp. And this is a no wipe matte top coat. And here I'm showing you that you do want to wipe off your brush on a wipe that has some isopropyl alcohol on it because when you are top coating, you will get small little pieces of glitter and you don't wanna transfer those back into your top coat. And here's what it looks like with the one layer of matte top coat. And I am going to come in and apply my second layer. And like I said before, it's just that for me, it smooths out that texture more and that's the way I like it. And here's what it looks like all finished, but it does have some rough edges with the glitter. So I am going to come in with my file here. It's a 240, 320, so it's extra fine and I am just going to file around the edges here and take off those little rough bits of glitter. I really fell in love with the black and white fine glitter and I wanted to demo that for you because it was one of my favorites. So it's applied just the same exact way as before and I will let you watch this and I'll meet you back at the end.
and see the brush here this is what I'm talking about it will have glitter all over it even after you brushed it off so be sure to wipe it off on your wipe with isopropyl alcohol before you put it back in your bottle here I wanted to show you what this glitter looks like when it's shiny and then next to the matte nail now it's time to apply some nourishing cuticle oil and this is from the born pretty store as well and this is for individual use because it is a roll-on and that's the end of the video thank you so much for watching please take advantage of the 20 percent off coupon code that you see on your screen when you visit born pretty to do some shopping and i'll see you in the next one bye